Hi everybody, it's Sam at Mixed Up Craft and I've just received the latest Trim Craft Design Team package. I am so excited. I have been waiting eagerly by the door. Um, actually, it's been a really nice day of crafting and this is just the cream on the top. So I have only just undone the tape. I haven't done anything else. So I'm gonna unbox this with you all now. Okay, so first up, we've got the Gardenia collection from first edition. And these papers are beautiful. I mean, they just scream spring. And I know there's snow outside at the moment, but what a joy to have these. They are freezing cold as well. So <laughs> I can tell that they've been um, obviously traveling for some time, but nonetheless, let's get into them. So I'll just show you the print from the eight by eight. 12 by 12 is exactly the same. It's just blown up bigger, but let's just have a little flick through. So as always, you get your pearlized, you get two pearlized designs, two fabric textured designs and one spot UV design, and then half the rest are double-sided. So, which is always nice. Just gonna take that off the back there. Okay, so yeah, look at that. Look at the pearlized pattern there. Beautiful, all your spring, not necessarily just spring, but just pretty flowers, lovely blooms really really lovely colours and it's nice to now start creating yeah some new projects I'm ready to move on now and start using some other things so here's all your butterflies really pretty again pearlized they'd be nice to fussy cut as well this one I love it's textured and it's a wood grain you can just see there it's a real dark wood grain but that's going to look really lovely it's almost like an olive green actually when you see it so that's that one we've got this one here which is full of bees bumblebees all over and that's again another um, fabric one and then you've got this one here which is gorgeous that lovely like dusty rose beautiful this one with the watering cans and they've got the little robin on the top there and the butterflies again I really love that one and the bigger version of that again will be really nice to fussy cut this one here is those same birds but just on their own gorgeous prints this one here has got this kind of textured the textured background really it's really nice thanks a bunch love love blooms let your dreams be kind grow celebrate or time to celebrate but it's 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 spelt the way um time the herb spelt so i really like that love blooms so i think that's it then it just repeats again but you've got the dragonflies you've got spades you've got the bird boxes really it's just really lovely perfect if you've got a lot of nature lovers people who love being in their garden yeah it's going to work well look at that one that is great for any keen gardener for their birthday card and i like that it's like the old style my nan well actually we had one but my nan had one as well and it's the the push lawn mowers i do i've got memories of, of doing that and even doing it myself so i really like the the vintage style there and these are now the double-sided ones so you've got the dragonfly on the back there which is really lovely that's gorgeous that reminds me of something as well trying to think now I think it might have been a book I read when I was younger but I really like that style and then on the back there you've got that nice polka dot so this is a really good pack for male and female cards uh, you've just got such a nice variety here and, and the colours are just so different it's lovely there you go another butterfly one with the stripes I always love a stripe with like a polka dot or a, a print I think they look really good so that stripe with that looks great love ladybugs or well, ladybirds but ladybugs really love them and i've got a really nice bug stamp set and i saw this and i just thought it's brilliant so you've got them just kind of walking and then you've got them flying as well and they're really good again the larger ones and look i this is brilliant this is so me you've got snails and you've got like little critters there other bugs beetles love it really like it some of you now be going oh no it's you know not sure about bugs and stuff, but they look great and they're good for kids' cards and yeah, just think they're, they're lovely. That one is full of all your different bird boxes. Wonderful. Wellington boots or welly boots. Love it. Love, love, love. That's gorgeous. That's really pretty with the yellow butterflies all over. And then you've got that lovely print there. Another nice one with the acorns and all your different oh gosh what are these called the little propellers somebody write in the comments it's totally gone now and you'd um, pick them up from the floor throw them in the air and then they'd twist down love that it is it's making me think of my childhood this paper pack because i was always outside so great great memories and there you go you can see the other checkered print there 
that's like your kind of garden tablecloth yeah really nice that's the end there so like i said the other pack is just the same prints but just blown up i love look, the little snail there i've also got a really nice stamp set that i've just received which is going to complement this really well actually with the flowers so yeah i'm looking forward to using that but you can just see there's the wood grain how nice is that going to look so yeah Oh, it's so exciting. Right, let's pop this to one side because I know it's gonna start getting a bit heavy on my desk. Okay, next up is this one, which again, I absolutely, I mean, I love anything, which you can probably tell because what I've just showed you is so different to this. Yeah, I just love this as well. So I'm gonna just take it out of the packing. So as I, with all the others actually as well, this is 12 by 12 and eight by eight. I think they do six by six as well, um, but, We've just got the 8x8 and the 12x12 here, so same. So this one, no, this is different actually. So this is three glitter designs, two iridescent designs, and then half double-sided papers. And you can already see on the front there, just look at all those lovely patterns. Oh, can't wait. Oh my gosh. You know I love holographic print, iridescent prints. Oh, look at that. Can you just see it a bit better there? It's just got so much shine to it. Gorgeous. You've got three of those ones. Look at that. Oh my god, is that all the rainbow colours? That is so nice. And then you've got polka dot, and that's all glittered, it's all textured. Really lovely. Unicorns, look at that. And that's like that resist, it's almost like they've been embossed in white and then stamped on that rainbow background. So it's a really, really lovely design. I really do like that. So there's three of that one. This one's got great big diamonds in a real nice like mint green. So there's a diamond print on there. Oh, look at that. That's just so happy. So fun. I've got lots of unicorn stamps and dies. So I've got lots that's gonna really work well with this paper pack and I can't wait to start making more cards and bags and stuff. That's really pretty. Just a really nice floral page. Yay! I'm so pleased they've done this. Look at the little tags. Make dreams happen, magic. Make a wish, sparkle all day. I wish I was a unicorn, unicorn vibes. So these are great if you're doing a scrapbook layout. They're great for making gift tags and they're great for obviously using as toppers on your cards. So yeah, it's a real all rounder, this one. And then you've got a really nice like, ombre polka dot print there. And then this is your double-sided, so it says a lot of those words again. So I love you more than rainbows, sparkle all day, believe in the magic, shine bright, make dreams happen. Yeah, really lovely. And then this is your hearts with this just nice geometric print on the back. That's gorgeous. That's just like a watercolour wash. And being someone who loves watercolouring, that's really, really nice. Love that. And nice with the stars. You can see how well that complements each other. And then the rainbows, that's just Care Bears to me. That is literally Care Bears. <laughs> and I have seen a, a Care Bear stamp and die range that is coming out very soon and I cannot wait to get my hands on it. This is all just gonna be so nice. Oh, it's just, it's just brought so much joy to me right now seeing all these things. And like I said, when the weather's not great outside, yeah, this is just brilliant. Look at those, Isn't that lovely with the, and like shooting stars and with the yellow there. It's got tiny little triangles on it. And again, you've got that real nice ombre kind of pink into the purple there. And those work really nice together. That one there's just a, like a leaf design. Oh wow, look at that, that gorgeous unicorn there. With that flower background there. And then you've got like a honeycomb. And that one there, in fact, you know what, that honeycomb would work quite well with this one as well. Can you see there, that would look nice. So you can mix some of them. That's almost like um, sp uh, sprinkles. And that's it. Gorgeous. So I've got the eight by eight and the 12 by 12. Gift bags in this are gonna look amazing. They're gonna look so good. So that is that. Then we've got, oh, now you know how much I've loved the Dovecraft holographic, silver, gold, and rose gold mirrored cardstock. Well, this is, can you see there's the condensation inside? Because it's obviously so warm in here now, look. 
<laughs> that's how cold it is outside. This is the rainbow card pack, mermaid and unicorn card pack. So you know that's gonna look great with that chasing rainbows that I've just shared. And then this one here is the tropical card pack. So let's just see how great these colors are. Okay, so this is the rainbow card pack. So you get one of each color and there's eight colors. So there's, just look at that. <laughs> you know already I'm gonna be using this like all the time. <laughs> In fact, I'm gonna to have to get myself another pack because there's no way this is gonna last me at all. It will be gone. Just look at how amazing, just look at that. The, the camera's probably going crazy right now, picking up all of these wonderful, look at that. Wow. I mean that on your cards, when you're doing your mats and layers, is just gonna look amazing. So that is the rainbow card pack. <laughs> okay, let's put it away. Otherwise I'll just be staring at it for ages. Okay, next is the mermaid and unicorn card pack. So again, one of each color and eight colors and it's 250 GSM. Let me just check, what did that other one say? Because that one is 250 as well. So they're perfect for you. I always say 250 and above is perfect for your card mats and layers and even your card bases as well. So what have we got here? We've got a beautiful teal, it's like pearlized teal color. Then we've got that silver. We've got beautiful pink. We've got that real kind of fuchsia hot pink. Lovely mint green there. Sorry, my camera's really struggling. And then it's almost a peachy, peachy pink. A gold or, yeah, it's kind of like a yeah, yellowy gold, that one. And then this really lovely purple. Again, look at those, and they're so smooth. They are gorgeous. You could probably, well, I can't see why you can't, you can heat emboss on these as well. So stamping and embossing will be quite nice. Um, heat embossing, sorry, and even using your embossing folders. Embossing folders on mirrored or any kind of sh you know shimmer and pearlized cardstock just looks beautiful. So lots and lots and lots of ideas there. And then the other one is the tropical card pack. So again, one of each color and eight designs. So we've got here, Look at that gorgeous, it's almost like a lime green. And we've got that blue, a real brighter green there. That's a darker purple. That's almost like a neon kind of yellow, like yes, yeah, it's a yellowy green. Pink and that yellow gold. And then this one here is just a darker well, lighter to, no, it's a, yeah, it's a, mm, hang on, let me just grab that one there. No, this one is a little bit darker. There you go, so there's those ones there. Aren't they just gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Okay, okay, now this is the one I've been excited for and I've been teased with this for a while now. And this is the Fairy Tales, the new Dovecraft Premium Collection. It's absolutely gorgeous. And the, the thing that, again, I really like about this is that a minimum of 10,000 pound will be donated to the Mind Charity. I will share a link to the Mind Charity below. It's a fantastic mental health charity. So I think that's a wonderful thing. And it's nice to know that, you know, when we're purchasing things, we're also doing a good thing for charity. So yeah, wonderful. Okay, so the nice thing about the Dovecraft ones, they've done this on the, the Be Happy, I think it was. You always get this really nice kind of cover sheet with all the patterns. And again, that's really nice to use as well, you know, on any of your projects. So in here we have, I'll pop it on the side. They're all eight by eight, but it's more a nine by eight because they give you this kind of perforated one inch piece at the top here. So that's the actual eight by eight piece there. But this is just a nice leaf design. Then you've got this gorgeous, look at that. Look at those fairies. Isn't that pretty? It's all got that lovely sparkle on top. This one I really liked. Now some of you might be thinking, oh really? But if you look closely, it's just a really nice script and it's just handwritten. I mean, it's, yeah, I, I really can't work out what it says, but I, I do love that for backgrounds. I think it's very romantic. So I do like that one. This is a really nice pearlized one there. Isn't that gorgeous? Perfect for backgrounds. Look at that one there, another absolutely beautiful design. Then you've got the gorgeous butterflies there. 
These are just so textured, this is why it's their premium, Dovecraft Pleat Premium Collection. Then you've got that similar kind of fairy one, but this one's just your matte, so it's just, um, yeah, just a plain paper finish. Um, then we've got that one there, another gorgeous background paper, pretty butterflies. Again, it's just very, very pretty, very girly. Again, a really nice background paper there, so perfect for your mats and layers. Another nice one there with the butterflies. And then that one there, that's a really good one to fussy cut. So the paper pack is beautiful, but the best thing are the accessories. So let's just see, look at all these bits. Okay, so we've got the button and the buttons, the uh, bows. So you get 20 mini bows here, really nice colors. You've got that lovely kind of, um, not quite a neon green, but it's, it's kind of like it. It's just really pretty, I like that and it's different. Then we've got this, which I thought was lovely, and it is a gem sticker in the shape of a fairy. So let me bring in that there, and you can see, how cute is that? Really, really lovely. So that's gonna look, that would actually look really nice on a gift tag, just hanging off of a gift bag. So that's probably what I'll end up doing something. That's what I'll do with this, something like that. So that's the fairy. You always get your adhesive pearls. These are the flat back pearls, and I love that deep almost like, it's like a red, pink, whiny kind of colour, it's really nice, I like that. Then we've got these lovely sentiment toppers, perfect to go on your cards, and you can just see how perfectly it all matches, which is just great. Have a magical day, birthday wishes, just for you. Yeah, love them, really nice. This is brilliant, you, you get so many in it. It says 30 paper blossoms, but I've had these packs before, and there's always a few more, because they are, the way they're kind of, on top of each other, they almost get pressed when they get cut, so you always get that extra few. And again, they're all just really nice, all like pastel kind of colours. They're gonna look great, and then you imagine, you know, you've got one of these pearls in the centre of each one. They look really pretty. We've got these, so they are really nice doilies, paper doilies, you get 40 there, so again, absolutely tons. Pop that one under there. Look at these. These are fairy ones, oh my god. <laughs> they are metal, they are heavy, and they are just so cute. Do, 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 do. Excuse my um, black finger there, I was doing some stamping before my parcel arrived. But look, aren't they cute? And they've got a little ring here so you can hang them. So they look lovely hanging off the side of your you know, diaries and your planners and stuff like that. But also if you're doing little card designs, but oh my gosh, I just picture a little fairy now coming along my desk. I just think that's absolutely gorgeous. So that's them. You get 12, which is really good. Love them. That's something really different. Then you get your wooden frames. I am going to promise myself to try and use these because I must confess, even before I joined the Trimcraft team, this was the one thing that I would always get but I would never use. And I think I've maybe used it once in one of the collections in all the times that I've been buying Trimcraft. So Trimcraft, I'm gonna promise you, I'm going to try and incorporate these a bit more. I just don't know what it is. I just, they're always the last thing I go to. So, but every time I see people using them, I love the way that they've used them. So you get four of each design and there's three designs. So you've got, there is like a trellis print on that. You probably can't pick it up. And you've got that square print and then you've got that one there. So yeah. I promise I will use them. But again, there's so many there. So then these are beautiful. Look at those, the flowers. They get a little bit kind of misshaped, but they're quite easy to, to rework again when you take them out. You get 16 paper flowers there. Pegs, I always love the pegs. They're great on my, I use a lot of them in my albums and stuff. And um, they just look great, obviously, when you're making gift tags. There's different sizes as well. You've got tiny ones and you've got slightly larger ones, there's 35 in total, but that's all the pegs, which are great. Then, there's still more guys, there is so much to this collection. This was the other thing that I was excited to get. This is gonna look so good in a shaker card, and these are iridescent confetti, tiny, tiny fairies, and they look like Tinkerbell. Grab one, but look at that there. It's so cute. There is a embossed image on top. Again, it's quite hard for you to see it. Can you just work it out there? You can just see the embossed image of the fairy. 
and it's just so cute. There are tons, there are, well it's 15, just 15 grams. There are hundreds in there. I can't wait to use that. Like I said, that is shaker card, definitely. Then we've got these, which are your glitter pots. So you get four 15 gram glitter pots and look at those. You've got that lovely green, silver, blue and pink. Really nice. And I love using the glitter pots with my double sided tape. So if you want to create like a nice border on a card, you put a strip around your four sides and then you sprinkle the glitter over and it looks fantastic. So that will definitely be getting used. Then we've got some dies. So this is the Fairy Butterfly and the With Love. So you get three steel dies, but that fairy is going to be lovely. And again, die cut it in a few colours and then you kind of, a bit like paper piecing really, put it back together again with all the different uh, colours that you've used. So yeah, really nice. You can see them better on the back there. Really love that detail there in the fairy's wings. So it's that one. Then there's these, which again, something new and fun. And they're little shakers, six shakers there. And you've got fairy dust. That one says, again, fairy dust, and that one's just got the fairy in each one, and then fairy dust at the, again at the bottom. Again, how lovely are those? The, you, I say kids, but like, you know, oh, well, I love them and I'm an adult, but kids are gonna love this, it's just so fun. So that's that one. Then, this was another thing that I loved, 84 pieces glitter sticker books. I do love stickers, I use them lots. So I can't wait to use these. So you've got page there, all the different fairies, make a wish, have a magical day. So again, I stick these on card, then cut them out again, and they make nice little toppers for your cards. So you get one, two, two of that design. Then it will be, I guess, two of this design here. That's a lovely image. So one, two, then two of that design. There's loads of stickers in this. Brilliant. Again, that one and that one. This is great. Look at that lovely um, like wreath of butterflies. And I really like that with all the three little jars there, fairy dust. And then, yeah, that's it. How lovely is that? It's gonna get lots and lots of use. Then we get the ribbons. So we always get ribbons. This is five times one meter ribbons. Love that pink. Look at the sparkle on that. That's gorgeous. I believe in fairies with love. Got a nice green one there with the butterflies and then that one there as well. Gorgeous, absolutely love those. Then you get the buttons. Again, look at all of those. Wow. And again, you, these are great to use on your clothing. So if you've got a nice jacket or a pretty dress or something, then you know, use them on your clothing. You don't have to use them in your paper crafts. Um, and there's some plain colors there, like a plain yellow. You get 16 wooden buttons, really lovely. Got that lovely fairy stamp. Now I'm just thinking, did the die cut that out? But it's not, it wouldn't cut that out because they are, yeah, she's smaller. But still, I love, I'll be using my watercolors to uh, color her in. She's really, really pretty. And she's kind of catching the butterfly there. Then we've got these. Now I've been using this kind of butterfly for a long time. Um, so it was really nice to see this in a collection really and in different colours because I will probably still do what I always do and that's remove well that one's already come off there you go I prefer them like that because I just think that looks almost like I've got a real butterfly just sitting there on my hand isn't that gorgeous but you do then have that kind of holographic framed butterfly there as well so it's entirely up to you but that's how I will use them and you get eight there so really really nice okay can you see why I was so excited to receive all of this? <laughs> then we have got these so six A5 glitter cards. Now A5, I'm so pleased to see this in A5 because I make so many A5 cards. This is brilliant. So you get so two of each. So two of the silver, two of that beautiful rose gold, and then two of the gold there. And again, so much sparkle. They're going to look wonderful with this collection. Squeeze that under there. And then... The one thing I just love doing, and I was so excited to see it, is ta-da! The Glitter Decoupage Pack. Now I know loads of you are going to be going, yes! <laughs> because there's a lot of you that love using these as well. I used the Hell's Couple Ditch Christmas Village one over Christmas. I've used the Beach Life. I've used the Sweet Moments. I've used... Oh, see, there's loads. I love them. 
So again, let's just snip very carefully that one and that one. So you get 24 sheets, three sheets of eight designs, glitter effect, die cut out already, easily assemble, acid free. So let's see what lovely kind of scenes we've got made up here. So we've got the butterfly for anybody new who's never seen decoupage, because there's, there's two forms of decoupage. There's a decoupage where, well decoupage is basically to layer on top of each other, but there's decoupage where you cover like a box and you rip all your papers up and you use a lot of PVA glue. That's one form of decoupage. The other form is this. So you can see here, these just pop out. So that one will sit over there. That one will sit over the top and you put them all on foam adhesive. So you just get this lovely dimension and this really nice topper. And then that's pretty much ready to go. Just stick it down with a piece of paper from the paper pack some glitter paper there and put it onto a card base and they're just really quick cards but I love using them so that's that design then you've got this fairy one loving wishes look how cute they all are really really lovely then you've got one here again really really cute so that one says for a special friend then I love that one I've seen that one just for you isn't that gorgeous all that lovely like wreath effect there, you've got the butterflies. And you've got two, well you've got, yeah, two sentiments because you've obviously got the one that's already in there, so just for you. But you've also got thank you very much. Isn't that, oh, I love it. <laughs> I'm so easily pleased. Then this one, beautiful. Have a magical day. And you can mix and match as well. So you don't have to have the sentiments with this. You can change them up if you want to. And then, Look at that one. Again, I think that's one of my favourite images is these three little bottles. And I love that it's it's got that beautiful butterfly background. Make a wish. And then we've got this one, birthday wishes. All these tiny little ones. So these will all go, the tiny little um, foam dimension pads on top of these here, these four. So there's so much detail in this, it's gorgeous. And then I think this is the last one with love. And you've got that single fairy there. And then all these lovely little details here. So just follow your numbers and it will all, it's very, very easy to do. And I will share when I come to do them, I'll, I'll do the tutorial and show you how to put them together as well. But look at that, isn't that gorgeous? So there you go, guys. I can't get everything in. I'm just going to keep this here because as you can see, there was a lot of product, but I'm a, I kind of now have to put it all away and then go to it because right now my brain is buzzing. <laughs> I've got way too many ideas. I don't know what to start with first. I think I've got an idea, but I'm going to wait. So yes, you will start to see me using this next week. I will try and share as many links as I can. I will pop it in my, I'll do a blog as well, blog post, and I'll have everything linked there. If you want to get your hands on it, I'll see how many, you know, hopefully, I think all of this is available already to buy. I know this is, but I'll need to check the other stuff. But anyway, there it is. Um, have a lovely weekend and I will see you all again next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.